Yo what's up guys welcome back to a brand new video and this one is on how to install updates or DLC files in Yuzu emulator. Now I actually kind of already made this video but that was specifically for Pokemon Sword and Shield the uh, DLCs and updates for that but because it has that exact name uh, people don't look for that and uh, they get confused. So from now, this is the tutorial on how to do so, and I will get all the update files for all the games I've made videos of in my Discord server. So yeah, make sure to do that. Also, make sure to subscribe, hit like, and comment down below if this helped you, or uh, yeah, if you have any problems, I would recommend going to the Discord, but uh, yeah, comment, like, it helps. All right, so now that we are in our Yuzu, if you don't know how to set it up, watch my most recent game guide on the channel right now. In here, we have our games. Today, I'll be updating my Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. So, literally what you gotta do is you go to File, Install Files to Nandi. You click on that, you find your update file, and you press Open. It will show this little confirmation box, and if you selected multiple files, multiple things will uh, be in here. But for me, this thing is checked and I do want to install that. So I click install, you'll see a little loading bar. Don't worry if it gets stuck, it just might just shoot up to like here sometimes. Just give it time, the faster your PC, the faster it will probably be done. Now this also works for DLCs the exact same way. That's why I'll always try to uh, also add DLCs to my Discord server. I'll add them eventually. If you have anything you really want added, ask in the Emulator Help channel on my Discord server because I'll be adding these slowly. Um, they're not already in, all right? So after this, you literally just installed it. Click OK, the background will refresh. Yeah, there we go. It already kind of says update 12.0. If you want to remove the update or DLC, since some of them, if you update to two new versions, it might not work or an older version works better, you can go to remove and then remove installed update or all install DLC if your DLCs is what is uh, breaking it. You can remove caches and stuff, but watch out with that. Um, yeah, you can also just turn them off instead of removing them by uh, going to properties and here I already unticked it but I am gonna take it so it's on and then I just press ok. That is basically all for the newest Yuzu EA build. Check the description or my discord server. I update those links more frequently and yeah as I said like subscribe and comment down below and yeah follow my twitch that's all I gotta say so peace.